carbon imprint is what we're trying to reverse engineer to go back to. What we have here is we have a green built, completely self-sustaining, fully transportable home. The dimensions are 40 feet by almost 13 feet and we can do whatever the customer would like. We've got designs that we're doing for a potential customer that has eight shower and bathroom units, so they're segregated for some construction workers. We've got a design for the same group that, that uh, is a professional kitchen, so we think these will go well with the other eight configurations that we already have. We've created a product that is uh, the lowest formaldehyde and VOC emissions of any product of its type. Uh, it's completely self-sustaining. We have a filtration system that purifies up to 110 gallons of water a day. Then that water can be released back into the environment with zero impact on the environment. Make something completely portable and completely sustainable, completely all in one unit. I really like that idea. The concept's great and of being self-sufficient, the two weeks on the battery and solar, the ease of getting somebody set up right away, you know, two hours, three hours, whatever it is, I think it's, I think it's fantastic. The idea is that you could take this and put it in the middle of nowhere and set it down in a matter of hours with minimal crew, uh, no special training or skills required, and immediately begin providing a safe, comfortable living environment. We can pull it up to a site, lower the legs, expand it out within 15 minutes. Then it takes about an hour, an hour and a half to put the connection rods into the ground to hold it in place. So it's a very, very quick system. I think it's a really innovative design. There's all these disasters, there's, there's just a flood recently, and there's these tsunamis, and there's Katrina, and there's these hurricanes, and I think a unit like that, I'm surprised that it hasn't been made before. I think it's really, really awesomely cool, especially for our clients that are demoing their houses and need some place to stay temporarily to put something like this in. It's 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 like a home away from home. This is as good as it gets in terms of housing. It's a concept long in coming. It has its own energy system. Uh, it's capable of running off of solar power, biodiesel generator, uh, it has rechargeable batteries. These aren't standalone systems. These are all fully integrated systems so that if any one of the systems are only charging a small amount, the other system takes the space of the others. Now, if we deploy these units with our hub system and connect up to 250 units to those hubs, we can actually sell power back to the, uh, to the grid itself. So we're able to not only create a system that is dynamic in its effect on the environment, we have a system that's dynamic on effect on power generation. So we're hoping to be able to use this system in many, many different locations and areas of, of, of the United States and, and across the world.